Hello there, everybody. It is me, No Name of Some Sport, back with Riddle Waves 3 as France. It is October of 1930, and I've now realized that I can reserve the aircraft carrier Bjorn. Um, currently, we're in a situation where we're rebuilding a bunch of ships. We're about to get two more uh, Saber class destroyer leaders done. We're also building the uh, Protet. Um, Destroyer leader class once those sabers are done and once these uh, turregs are back out I will probably redo my um, destroyer divisions and they got a bunch of uh, Older DDs about to rejoin you know rejoin the fleet trade protection destroyers in addition to that we're two turns away from Latouche Treville um, commissioning and then uh, Forbin is four months away from completing you know, the first in a series of two rebuilds, which will result in a much more expensive, in much more expensive rebuild. I have a bunch of money right, saved up right now, and I'm kind of trying to spend it. Um, but the first task today is to get these ships rebuilt. Um. Okay, I'm not sure I can get away with the X superimposed turret on this, especially if I'm gonna try to get. Uh... Yeah, I don't. I don't think I can. Thinking about it, four. Yeah, especially when I'm trying to get a bunch of uh, other stuff here. Well, let's move these a little bit more back, like JK. Ripples. I want a float plane and a center line catapult. Um, so yeah, this is what I wanted last time. Alright, I need anti aircraft guns too. That's a problem. Where am I getting those from? I guess less rounds per gun. Hmm. Okay, that gives me more upgrade room. I was thinking just a little nope. Um Yeah. Yeah, okay, that's probably about what I'm getting. Uh I'm gonna get rid of that. I'm actually gonna convert it into an R and shift its position probably. Let me get How about that, so we get a little bit of a better heavy anti aircraft factor. I can technically get that in. And I think I will. Alright. So this isn't the best of uh, light cruisers here. And I'm going to have to rework, like, all of the superstructure. So, um, yeah. Oh, hey, hold on. Those are all circle black. Hopefully. Um, but yeah, hopefully that should be somewhat doable. Position the aft turret further back. Um, yeah, this should work, right? Ah, I'm gonna stretch. Actually, here, let's bring this down to eight. Get the extra medium. Bring it up to 10. I was hoping to get, like, a little bit of turret armor. But apparently not. 
We don't really have a lot of room for upgrading, though. But if we do upgrade this, I'll probably just reduce the sec bat to 8 rather than 10. Um, okay, let me get rid of the boats. At the very minimum. Get rid of structure five and uh maybe not structure six. I'll I'll reconsider on that. Yeah, this structure might actually remain here. Uh, let me look up some uh, historical examples of this. I did not actually close all my Chrome tabs. Um. French light cruisers. So, what I want to be looking at is see the John Dyer. Cruiser Jean Arc, not that one. Um, nineteen thirty one. Cruiser, um, World War Two. I don't want to take a look at, uh, Vaguely how they lay out the superstructure on these. Um, well, I think this ship's going to have a bigger funnel. Let me get rid of these like little three-foot rectangles. I do think that's a fairly appropriate spot for a catapult. Okay. So five will be um actually how about this? I get rid of structure two. Uh hold on, there's a rectangle here. No. Yeah, remove that one. Alright, so structure two is gonna be rebuilt now. Actually, how about, hmm, I know the historical trip doesn't have this, but I don't care. Actually, the historical ship does look different, so this isn't going to be an exact replica. I just going to kind of model some of the bridge shape off of it, and even then, um, I'm not even sure I'll do that fully. Okay, then we get structure five. So, um, put this start structure five here, back over. Do this. Do this. And then that can be kind of incorporated uh, somewhat into the mast. Um, Actually, I think I will get rid of uh, structure six back there. 
Let me uh, position the guns a little better. That position on these guys. Actually, that's probably a good spot for them. that gun will go there. Although, um, let me go to graphics, remove the remaining two boats, the visual. Actually, hold on, we have a, uh, where is it? The position of this mast pole with simple Cross tree back there for now. Um, yeah, I wanted to mess with uh, potentially the location of these two. Question is, do I want these guns here? Or do I want the guns up here and the, the torpedo tubes back here? I think I'll put the guns more here-ish. You know, a little bit more in line with the forward pair. Then, all right, no. You're fine. I want to position the torpedo tubes. Back there. The graphics, um... I'm gonna move this up. Okay. So six is not currently placed. I'll probably mess with this one somewhat. I guess our, the question is, how much of this are we trimming down? Um, yeah, I think I am just going to remove it here and say that we have effectively trimmed it down. Um... Okay. Across, back. Do that around the funnel. Okay, cool. Okay, let's let me put boats in. Oh, look at the little tiny boat next to the other boats. That, that boat looks too small, actually. Alright, 25 foot with division. See if that fits in. Barely. Probably want two more boats back here. So what do I want? Maybe 28 with divisions. Yeah, we can do like two twenty eights with divisions. That'll work. Mirror. And then I need a crane. Press angle to maybe 13. That'll work. So that crane would be able to offload both the boats and the float plane. Catapult rotating I need. Press angle to 180. Actually, no. That rest angle back to zero. 
And honestly, the catapult's just already in a really good position. I like, kind of like having the catapult exactly amidships here. Where is float plane 2 medium? Pressing with 180. Then about there on the catapult. Uh, I'm going to move the guns again. that move that That about there. Yeah. Do like a circle twelve foot then that Do about there. And I need a little rectangle astern. Okay, I think that works. The secondary gun. Secondary mount graphics mismatch. Yeah, I have 10 of them. Of course they do. Alright, um, that will be two old light cruisers refit into something a little bit more, uh, a little bit more viable. It can broadside, dual purpose secondaries, a little faster, you know, kind of that minimum 27 knot speed. On the waves. Come on. Okay, give it a moment. There we go. Thank you. That is going to be pretty expensive. And that's going to take 12 months to refit these ships. But, you know, that's like now a vaguely modern CL. Ignore, 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 ignore. Okay, um, I am fully expecting to this episode I have to do basically the same thing to Ob, Sully, and uh, Forbin. Those ships will get the same treatment and also go in for a pretty major rebuild. Two spheres are commissioned, 23 have finished their reconstruction, should give me more money, um, you are my ally, so by all means... Gradual improvement of armor quality. New float plane is for research. Austria's seeking helps from leaks in our industry. Okay, so now all these guys can be mothballed to save a little bit of funds. Uh, these destroyers are now working up. Okay, reserve them. One turn away from these guys completing their rebuild. Then we also get the uh, cruiser uh, Latouche Treville. I just now realized how expensive all this is going to be because I'll be refitting what, like, 
Ooh, she's surpassing her design speed. Awesome. Um, we'll be refitting what, like one, two, like two heavy cruisers. Actually, no. We'll be we're refitting Leon Gambetta, so we'll be refitting three heavy cruisers. Um, or major refits on three heavies simultaneously, as well as three lights, plus building two new battleships, and two new CVs, and eight new destroyers. This is going to be expensive. Although, actually, right now the cost is uh, vaguely sustainable. Move the Toregs into the reserve fleet. The Epes will probably need a rebuild here relatively soon. Um, oh yeah, you need a commander. Ability? Um, I think the average gunnery expert good ad or good admin. We'll get on that ship for now. Okay. Um, two, two, or too few destroyers. I'm building eight right now. We're we are constructing more destroyers actively. I'm gonna need to keep constructing more, but it's gonna be a little bit difficult to sneak them in the budget. <laughs> Can I get? ANYTHING DONE?! FOR PETE'S SAKE?! Alright, that, uh, immediately delays any rebuild to Ob, Sully, and Gambetta. Um... Jesus Christ! Or if you can give that event, all the officers have been complaining about destroyers. Just give me one for destroyers. Stop trying to micro. You are trying to micromanage the Navy's construction here. And yeah, I'll get. These guys are gonna get delayed at this point. Hmm. <sighs> All right, um, where did all these extra Tershback guns come from? Hold on. Which one, which one are these two? Okay. So that mount shouldn't... You know what? Clear tertiary graphics. Okay, um... <sighs> it's like, oh yeah, I'm trying to build us new battleships. What, do, what are you gonna do? More, more battleships. Great. Great. Um... Alright, um... Accommodation, I will stay with spacious engine priority. I will go to normal to save a little bit of weight. So if we look at the gun data right now, we're using a 16-inch belt. It is cheaper if I can just get by with a 16-inch rather than a 16-inch inclined. Um, we'll do a 15.5, actually. So a little bit lighter on the belt. Oh, she's got a lot more topside load now. For some reason. Um, I might go 27 knots. Just a little slower. Uh, no hanger? Thinking? You need to save some money somewhere. I might go 16 inch guns. Go with the 16 inch belt. And I'll go normal accommodation. Uh, I'll stay spacious so that these things can live a little longer. Okay. God damn it.
Why why are you making me do this? I had a little bit more deck extended. Yeah, we'll do a 48,000 ton ship here. I'll do a little bit more. All right, um graphics department Let me get rid of structure three. And uh I'll, I'll I mean we'll I'll do some some form of construct back here, like an anti aircraft gun platform. Two, four, six, eight? Yeah, okay. Okay, mirror, 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 and mirror. All right, then. Um... I guess we got a uh, new battleship, same armor as um, yeah, basically the same armor as the uh, preceding Grishlias, but um, just trying to save more, trying to save a little bit more mass. Actually, she has a little bit better deck extended, but like yeah, pretty much same armor. Um, reduced stats otherwise to just save some cash. Actually, if we go down to, like, 15-inch guns. No, I'll stay 16s. I think I need ship I need fast uh, battleships with 16-inch guns. Okay, then! Uh... Crap. That's what we're gonna have to build. Oh, hold on. Who has no commander assigned? One of my new cruisers. So we have an above average on a sign. Okay, you can go you can go on the new on that cruiser. Ah, uh, fascist coup has taken place in Spain. Interesting. I really hope that we don't go to war with Germany soon, because I am not prepared. Cruisers have finished a reconstruction. Honestly straight into mothballs at this point. Yeah, I'm sorry, Ob and Sully, I can't- I don't have the budget to refit you anymore. I was really hoping that I would be in the clear a little bit. But, um, no, must have six- six battleships building. Same with you, Forbin. I'll come back to you when I can. Oh, god, where did all the commanders go? Where did all the commanders go? Where did all the commanders go? What happened? Left the service, left the service, promoted, lost his edge. Um, promoted, 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 promoted. Dear God, okay. Lots of management this turn. Oh, he's below average now. Alright, who can I actually promote? These are Eily class, so Eily class are actually okay. I probably want to grab average from these older, like, de Goitois. Or anything else. Actually, I could grab the above average from Tej. Or Forbin. Okay, let's grab, um, that guy. Um, do you have anyone in charge of a destroyer division who's actually, like, good? Nope. Okay. 
Grab you. Grab you. I'll grab you. I am not... I have not been getting, like, good cruiser commanders lately. Alright. Sully. Okay, we do have a couple above average commanders. So, Aquaton. Does need a new commander. You will get that guy. Uh, France. You will get that guy. Sully will probably have to settle for an average commander. Uh, I could grab the guy from, uh... Nah, probably not. Will you take that as a slight? No, you won't. Which means you need a new commander, which uh, you'll get an average. Okay. Who doesn't have a commander anymore? Oh, right, I removed... Okay, second cruiser has no commander. Um, You get him... I thought I removed one from uh, Coastal Destroyer Division. That was not the case. Actually, I was supposed to redo my uh, divisions there. New docks completed, but let's... You're my ally. New torpedo bomb prototypes are ready for evaluation. Um, okay, so... None of these have as good of range. They do have better speed. I think this one's best. Press proposals for a new aircraft. We do have dive bombers, so you're yeah, you're gonna be bomb load and range. Uh, I mean, how about I resume construction on the uh, originally was right now. I have enough money. And, uh, it might, maybe what I'll do is I'll send, like, one cruiser of Solly and Ob and that group in at a time. Um, but yeah, this is gonna seriously delay any more destroyer building programs, which is what I need. They used to have 100 prestige, though. Uh... Let's have a pissed off piss off Austria a little bit. Weight savings in torpedo mounts, night air operations. Guy left the service, two guy got promoted. Were they in charge of everything? That was uh Liberty's commander. So Liberty you get an average commander, division editor. Seems like that guy wasn't really in charge of anything, so, um... Alright! Time to bankrupt myself by building six battleships at once! We have too few destroyers! Can, can you offer a destroyer building program? And our security arrangement with Italy has expired after the war. Great. And, uh, that also means that we're probably getting close to the point where, um... Another war is possible. Ooh, that's a pretty dangerous ship. 27 knots, less armored. Then we're building lighter steam turbines. How long? Because I'd love to get that lighter steam turbines in on these, but I don't think I have the time to do so. All right. Let's just start building them. I do I do want a battleship called Normandy. I probably should have named these uh that class. I'm gonna get one called I'll get Normandy, I'll get Sus. This is gonna be so expensive. Um, let's go guess it's gone. 
Oh my Jesus Christ. And the the extra secondary guns just place themselves magically again for some reason. I don't know why it keeps doing that. Alright. We should have nothing to worry about. Yep. It's fine. They're all gonna complete. Or not complete, but they're all gonna build. There's a very real chance that I start, like, halting one of these. And Gambetta has finished her reconstruction, so she's now modernized. Um, I probably do need to refit Victor Hugo's engines. <sighs> God damn it, Naval Minister. Fuck off. Just fuck off, Naval Minister, please. Stop ordering me to build a bunch of stupid ships I don't need as much, especially when I'm trying to do other stuff. It's like, oh, I want to modernize my cruisers. No, instead I'm building more cruisers. It's like, I'm trying to squeeze in... I'm trying to squeeze in what I want to do between the naval minister's request. Let's get that relationship with Italy back again. All right, um... Okay, so Sully's the slower one right now. So I think I will do a machinery rebuild on her. Um, and now we go up to 8-inch. All these zero guns. Um, I think 180 rounds will be fine. Uh, advanced director, I'll only do two turrets. Um, four inch wind dual purpose mounts. I might reduce the turret armor. Oh, hold on, hold on. I forgot to do this. No wonder I had so much weight remaining. And uh, let's do Turret Era Dreadnought now. How much is this costing? Costing 47,000. Uh, so it's a bit expensive, but I still think that this rebuilds is uh, cheaper than like a new ship. All right, so let's do a seaplane hangar. Um, do like an H and I catapult. I'm gonna clear the underwater mounts. Like DEFG torpedoes. So, you know, we'll have a pretty good torpedo broadside on these things. God, I can carry seven float planes. Uh, imagine just doing like a float plane strike from this. It would be incredibly based, actually. Honestly, how does more conning tower? Wait. Oh, you cannot change the conning tower's thickness. So I could change. I could add a little bit more upper belt armor. Um. How about we go like twenty four sec back guns? Uh, oh, 20. Oh my god. Well, this is a very expensive rebuild at 51,000, but, like, damn, look at the ship we're gonna get out of it. Um, yeah, have to do a similar one for, uh, Aw, but, but I don't think that'll be this episode at this point. Um, Ob might even just sit the next war out.
Um, okay. So what do I want to get rid of now? Uh, leave the anchor chains. I'll leave the breakwater. I'll leave those in. Actually, hold on. Let me check. Leave two. Get rid of four. Get rid of six. I'll get rid of three. Actually, you know what? Move that CV island. Okay, uh, clear the funnels. Remove the deck ventilators. And, of course, remove the boats. I'll remove the catapult and the float plane, which are currently in there. Okay, okay, okay. Making making some progress on this. Um, I'll remove that visual. I'll remove that visual. Um... I'll remove that visual. Um, actually, I'll remove that, that, and this. Okay, so there we go. We're down to just three visuals now. I'm going to reduce the spawns and radius down to five. Um, okay, so the forward superimposed turret will go back there. Um, position the X turret. I think the X turret going there is fine. Ooh. Actually, it would be really fun to squeeze the W turret in here, I think. How about I position that there, and then go into layer 5. That layer 5 just slightly back. Give that turret just slightly better arcs. Okay then. Um, actually, how about with the torpedoes? Uh, I get rid of D and E. I add. Actually, here's. What, I'm gonna clear the catapults. I'm gonna move these to. Okay, let me clear the torpedo mounts. Let me add the catapults more forward to like FG. I'll do HIJK for the torpedo mounts. So we'll have the torpedo mounts further back. Um, I'm thinking I position them kind of down here. And then... uh. Ah oh, man, this is... Sully's going to be kind of overpowered now. This is this is a complete overhaul, but it's it's so fun to do. It's so fun to do this sort of overhaul. I'm going to be honest. All right. So, I'm going to do two big funnels, I'm thinking. Um How about this? I might move this turret. I probably will move the turret. We'll have the forward funnel here. 
and then the aft funnel like here. Um, Is the fucking Rambow still on the boat? That's great. Alright, so I'm going to take the C turret and position her, or position it roughly here. Actually, let me move this fourth funnel just slightly forward. There we go. Alright, so now I need to find spots for all of the secback guns. I don't think late dreadnought quite works. No, no. That position. Uh, set rest angle. 270. Actually, I need to get the catapults on. Um... Okay, so imagining she's operating float planes. I'll say off of like here. Okay, so that gives me an idea of where the float plane hangar should be. Um, which is why I wanted to put those down. Let me grab for this back port sec back gun. I think you can be stuck about there. Oh god, it's glitching. I just lost. I just lost the design because I misclicked. Oh no, I didn't. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Um. Okay, auto place the sec bat again, cause uh, this is screwing up. Set position. You know, set the position of the first set there, the position of the second set, like, uh, for now I'll do there. Um, okay, so the hangar would go roughly here-ish, so I don't want to actually put any sec -back guns there, which means I probably want those guys forward. Right, okay. So. Move. Me, um. Move. Remove. Oh god, what is going on here? What is going on here? Um, let me remove everything starboard then. Okay. Everything starboard is gone. Fine, fucking auto place them. Alright, we're having difficulties here. Forward set there. Then it is these two. I only get one move with this guy. I will place him there. Okay, 
Hopefully that mystery turret doesn't keep showing up. It does, it does look like there is a glitch with uh, some of these. Okay. So set rest angle. Way. So I'm going to say two, maybe 290. Set rest angle. Maybe like 240. These. Okay. That kind of works. Okay, how about on this, so, structure, five, um, remove this kind of back a bit, uh, I'll move out here a little bit, so that structure kind of gets rebuilt to, uh, fit the extra guns on it. Okay, so structure three, four, and six I have to play with. Um, three, four, and six. So one of these, I'll do three for this, is going to have to be kind of this uh, forward superstructure bit here. Uh, Gun-wise, I'm going to take the C turret and position it just slightly further, slightly further down. I might actually take um, the three and four funnel and move them up a little bit. Although I'm trying to think about where I would put the boats. You know, let's move the three and four funnel down a bit and try to see if we can get boats in here or cranes. Maybe the cranes go here or here-ish. Okay, so structure four is going to more so represent the hangar, so... Actually, I can't even use that extra, like, carrier structure there. Actually, not. hold on. Structure four. Start structure four from, like... I don't know, back here, we'll do like this, 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 and go up. Um, go here. Uh, you know what? I'm really glad I didn't completely lose the ship. I thought for a moment I had, and it's just like, oh god. Alright, so... Remove the CV island. So that, that, that would be the hangar area. Um, there's probably a bunch of anti-aircraft guns on top of it. Actually, you know what? Yeah, I can do this. That that works well enough. I needed that just a little bit further back. All right. Let's do catapult rotating. Press single to 180. Mirror. Want float planes. Okay, that's actually now slightly clipped into that, so I gotta move that over to the side. 
I'm going to remove that catapult. I'm going to set the position of this catapult a little bit more to the side. And then with that, I'm going to set or reposition the catapults themselves a little bit more to the side. There we go. Um, all right, graphics, mirror, mirror. All right, now the float planes just fit in around the funnel. Uh, which is fine. Um, actually, hold on. I'm going to remove the second float plane. I will replace the first one here, but I need a moment. I'm going to add a boat 28 foot with divisions. I think, yeah, like below the wing, like about there. So I imagine that the catapults are elevated and then we have a little bit of like a boat deck here. Um, so mirror that, mirror that, move, you know, mirror that, mirror, mirror, remove. Okay, there we go. Now the float planes are on top of the boat. On top of the boats. Um, okay, now I need structure six, and I think I am going to put structure six more forward here. Alright, so uh, what I will do is... Not this, I'll do... Okay, you know what? We'll add the conning tower in there. Then I can do a little, like, I don't know, section like this. I really want to. And then that will actually allow me to easily kind of put stuff on top of that. Man, I'm, I'm actually kind of liking Sully's rebuild outside of, like, this turret being stuck there, but the game is glitching out. It won't let me fix that. Let me get a rectangle solid large in probably about here. I'll do a rectangle square too, like a big one, maybe a 21 foot. Uh, no, I'll do a smaller square. Actually, I won't do that yet. I feel like right now that's not the best thing to do because I want to be able to get the forward and aft superstructure built first. Uh, I actually like that size of circle. I think I just want like a medium gray version. I'll do a 10 foot medium. See a 10 foot medium gray. Like up. About there. I can do, you know, maybe not a rectangle solid large, but like a rectangle solid medium. Actually, no. Rectangle square. Try like a 14 foot, maybe. Too big. I do kind of like... Yeah, I do think that the rectangle square 14 foot works there. Let's try maybe a 12 foot. Uh, I'll do 10 foot. Actually, let's do a rectangle solid medium. That rest angle at 90. 
And uh, that's going to need to be a little bit off-center, but um, that can go there. Okay, that looks fine. That's where I need to shift it over. Single pixel? No. That's probably the best spot for it. Mass? I do need a new mast. Let's try... Mass tripod with triangle platform. That is way too big. Mass tripod for CL. I mean, okay, that does imply that a couple of the turrets are kind of underneath it, but okay, I'll I'll accept it. I will do a little uh, mast pull. Or is it? Mast pull with simple cross tree. Take that, put it on on about there. Okay, cool. I do need to do something stern. Okay. What? I need rectangle squares. Go 10 foot. Uh, too small. Actually, let's copy the other one I have. 14 foot, I think, would work. About there, and then let's copy a rectangle solid large um, back there. Actually, I'm going to get rid of that 14 foot. I will add in... What if I do some of the NN, like the bridge wrench size 2? The rest angle to 180. I don't think that's really working. Do need more boats. Okay, so let's try rectangle square 12 foot here. Like right about, you know, right about there. I need to get cranes in here. Ring two. Um. Bear that. I probably don't have a lot of space here. That's uh, another tripod back here. We don't, yeah, probably don't have many more of these uh, left. Okay, let me uh, copy the mass pole. Set that position, you know, back here. Okay, I do still have some room for additional boats. Let's do like a 30 foot with divisions. And a 30 foot with ends and center support. I think I'm mostly at 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 
122. I have three more decorations if I really want to put something on. Um, I'm going to build a rangefinder. Try maybe like a 20. Eh. Do a rangefinder 20 foot. Um, like that works well back there. I don't think I can fit that in up front. Range finder 15 foot maybe. Then mirror that. That position of this now. Back there and then Rest angle to 180 degrees. Okay, there we go. Where the fuck did I add flight deck armor? But I don't. We don't have flight deck armor. Where, mm, where the hell do you think I have flight deck armor? It is zero. It is zero right now. What is wrong with you, game? Okay. Let's take this. It is zero. It is zero. See, it is zero. Hmm. Uh, yeah, uh, that is an immediate go to rule the waves and ask for help. Uh, the rule is thing and. Oh. That didn't capture the screenshot? God fucking damn it. Uh... I don't know what's going on. I, I don't know what's going on. There's no flight. I don't have flight deck armor, game. Okay, you know what? How about we install a flight deck in? Okay. Okay. I'm aware. I add any. Okay, so let's go back to here. <sighs> I just did all this fucking work and the game's just like, no, get fucked! <sighs> I probably have to do the entire rebuild over again. We have no flight deck! Do you understand that? There is no flight deck on this ship game, you fucking moron. Alright, um, I'm just gonna save this as solely rebuild. Um... Um... Uh...
Um, I hate you! I hate you, Roll away. I'm so done. I am broken. I am actually broken. I have to go back in and just redo everything I just fucking did. You know what? Next episode. See ya, everyone. I'm mad. Bye. I will save, though.